You know, starting a business can be hard work. It takes time, commitment, and in most cases, money. It's that third thing that actually stops a lot of people from starting the business. And the funding can be hard to come by, especially in third world countries. But with a little help, an individual may be able to start a business and provide for their family for generations. And when a local contracting company heard about a way to help these individuals, it jumped at the opportunity. I caught up with the folks at Bay to Beach Builders to find out how they're using their skill sets to help others. Derek and Carla Parker know what it's like to be small business owners. They started Bay to Beach Builders in 2003 and have since become one of the area's premier contractors. They're now using their business to help families around the world pull themselves out of poverty. We've been really blessed here on Delmarva with uh, a great team and, and uh, some wonderful clients, and we just wanted to share that blessing. Working with their suppliers and trade partners to gather donated and discounted materials and labor, Bay to Beach Builders is constructing a brand new home to be sold with all the proceeds going to Homes for Hope an organization that supplies small business loans to entrepreneurs in third world countries. The main reason we chose this organization was because it's really a hand up and not a hand out. These are loans, these are not gifts. Um, these, these loans go to help them create small businesses that will be sustainable and, and could potentially uh, change, change the lives of families for generations. Homes for Hope reports that the average loan is just $34.01 and that 98% of these loans are repaid, allowing them to turn around and loan the money to someone else. Our, our goal is to ultimately be able to donate over $100,000 to this organization. We've been told by Hope International, the, the, the parent company, the parent organization, that there'll be over 500 families impacted by the sale of this home. That home is a two-story, three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath Cape Cod in Bridgeville. This is not a, uh, a bare-bones house by any means. Uh, we put a lot of nice features in this home, and um, uh, we hope to have it done in February, and then it'll go on the market and be sold. But it's the fact that this home has the potential to change the life of more than just its buyer that makes it extra special. You know, to, to be part of that, and, and it, you know, it's something that's it's a lot bigger than we are. And um, to be able to bring my team and, and to have the team involved, it, it really, it, it was really a, a team building experience for us as well as, as, as just a side benefit. Um, to see all of our trade partners come together and to really get involved, it just reinforces really the, the, the feeling of what good people we have to work with. Homes for Hope was started in 1998. Since that time, over 100 homes have been built, generating over $10 million in revenue. And Lisa, I have got to imagine that for that home buyer, it's a cool experience as well. You know, they're buying a new home and that money is going to help out a ton of people. That is such a great idea. It is an awesome what a great idea. business.